This arm pivots, letting us move our detector in an arc across the beam of alpha particles and out of it on either side at any angle. Our detector is light sensitive, so we'll place a shield over it and read its angle by this marker. Here are the alpha particles, about a half a million per second in the beam. The beam goes from here over to here, diminishing rapidly, and we'll mark this as the edge of the beam. In the same way on the other side. Here they diminish rapidly, and we'll mark this as the other edge of the beam. And now if we go beyond, we find none. Perfectly quiet. None of the alpha particles are deflected more than a few degrees from their original direction. What was that? A count? At this angle, that's 25 degrees out of the beam. There's another. That was three. Silence. Now let's put the gold foil back. What is going on? What was there about the structure of matter it would give rise to such violent changes of direction for a few alpha particles, and scarcely any for the vast majority.